freestyle like that at the beginning? 15 seconds. It's nothing. In the discussion. You shoot guns, you like to dance, my burner be cramping. In the discussion, nigga. Back at it. Charging up. Black skin, they loving this. Yeah. Then they loving this. What you saying now? What you saying now? What you talking about, Kelly? Uh, what you talking about? Uh, hey, DJ, what say you say saying? Long words. Get your brains on that curve. Niggas ain't playing. Better watch what you saying. You ain't all the way. You went away. Pretend just get the business. Grown man out here, full flash. Stop kidding. You be turned around your homies. Bitch up on your lonely. Now I see you freezing. Man, you looking like Jody. I be tired of these group troopers. Tough foofers. <laughs> What's yeah, good, y'all? Yo, y'all you, now live with us, the livest podcast TV in the nation, powered by Beacon Radio. Indeed. Gas Mask Tribe, where we filter out that bug. Yes, sir. We don't play that shit. We do entertainment, music, um, all that great stuff. Hey, y'all. Hey, what's up? Yeah, what's good? Sir. Please what's share up? this podcast. Please, please share this. Share this part by Beacon Radio. Share it. I am your host of the night. Biz, Shit, the entertainer, yo. or if you want to say Biz Dirty Harvard, go check it out. With my wonderful co host, who pretty much keeps me on track. It's so like, you tell me when it. I'm racist, when I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> we never said you was racist about last week. You know? I'll tell you at the show, fam. He's racist about somebody, something small. No, I'm not. Small, no, I'm not. I'm tell you about Zoe Johnson, thing. everyone. Oh, yes, boop, boop, Comedian, boop. actor, Zoe oh. Johnson, everyone. Turn it up. How you doing, man? Good man, how about yourself, bro? I'm doing pretty good. Yeah, it's gonna be a great podcast. Yeah, tonight. I'm looking forward to Indeed. it, bro. Also, also, I have my uh, my uh, I call him like my he's like a little big brother, you know what I mean? Yes, sir. You know, you like uh, a chameleon in a lot of ways, you know, which you don't know. I think you have to be exposed to that because of uh, certain people see it inside of you, yeah. you know what I mean? They're like, yo, I think you could do this, and you like, you master that, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> But uh, D him. Jamal, everyone is yeah, in the building. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Boing Boing himself. I heard a lot about you, brother. Yeah, yes, sir. Sir. You live on Beacon Radio? Right Papa Z Films Papa in the building. Papa Z Films. Yeah. Y'all ain't seen that beat. Also, here. the one and only master at hands on the ones and twos that keeps me on track. Um, pretty much let me know where I'm going out of bounds and. Yeah. Where the podcast could have been a lot better, where we should educate ourselves more on this podcast. He helps me out a lot. Dr. Phil Morrison, everyone, give him a round of applause for the ones and twos. Dr. Phil on the ones and twos. He's actually telling Zoe. Look, he's telling you what to do. Oh, right do. here. Yeah, yeah. speaking. Oh, 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 okay, there we go. There we go. Oh, okay, okay, what's up? Yeah, see? And we're see? on. There go. See? We go. And back. We're he on. on. You see, man? We're gonna let you know, nigga. You ain't speaking right, son. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Get it together. What's wrong with you, son? Speaking the mic. How you doing? How you doing, man? How was your week so far? Oh man, my week is great. Yeah. All the time. Pimping as usual. You know, I stay hard grinding, man. <laughs> right. You gotta grind. That's right. I got a vision, millions. That's right. That's, right. That's right. That's right. That's right. You know, you really keep me on track, man. You really, like, uh, even tonight, like, I had a whole different theme. I was going to go with Black Corona. But, you know, talking about it with you and having a, a person who's, like, 20 years experience in this and, you know, from a person who's, like, uh, a few months. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> so having that uh, high uh, uh, credibility and, you know, running these TV shows, that's why I ended up getting Zoe. I was like, I need somebody, like, who's, like, sure. polished, you know what I mean? Who has an experience in the radio world, podcasting world? Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But then again, I need someone who's like, who's like a a, a guru at it. You know what I mean? So you Think need for two. yourself type of person, right? Right. Yeah. You need somebody who's a guru, and yeah. then you need somebody who's been doing it. Yeah. Yeah. So even though yeah, you come with this newness and this new polished world or whatever. Yeah. They're able to polish that and keep it in the content of where it can be developed and where people can digest. Keep a balance. Right. Absolutely. Right, exactly. Yeah. Keep a balance. But absolutely. Man. But you know what? I always I'm always learning though. You know what I'm saying? I don't care care how much I do something. We always still learning. Yeah. Right, you know right. Saying? I think that's the great All the time. I was telling yeah. uh I was telling um cousin on the phone earlier that, you know what I mean, like I never want to get to the point to where I I'm the smartest dude in the room. 
Yeah. Because right. I think after that point, now I lost. You know, yeah, what that's I mean? whack. Yeah, yeah it's I, super whack. I think Phil had yeah. all. I think Phil was smarter than all his homeboys, so he got no friends right now. <laughs> 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 yeah, Phil don't fuck with nobody. Phil, <laughs> <away. Yeah. laughs> let me get this money. Yeah, Do this. Away. You know what I'm saying? But tonight, yeah. man, tonight I want to really expound on uh, Dark Love. You know, I got a new album coming out real yes, soon. Sir. Uh, and I know we're going to talk about that with you tonight. You know what yes, I mean? Uh, your, your great endeavors and all your great uh, accomplishments. And I can't wait to expound on those. But this album is really Dark Love. And mm-hmm. um, d- it, it'll be out in about a few days from now. It'll okay. be released on all platforms, you know. Um, I end up going with uh, Distro Kid. Uh, I was going to try Ditto until I saw some news that Ditto was like the horrible, most yeah. musical distribution out there. Really? Yeah, yeah. I uh, haven't heard nothing uh, bad about ridiculous. Distro, though. Uh, I, I, but, yeah, I, I, I haven't heard anything about Distro Kid. My yeah. previous album, my U CD Baby, mm-hmm. and which did me great. I got an album. I, I got a song on um, on a, Span, a Spanish publishing company mm-hmm. in Spain. And that was through City Baby. So if you're thinking about it, City Baby might be a good one. But they don't charge no yearly fee. They only charge one fee. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. That's forever. But the percentage game is a little dip. You know, it's about can, like... Can, can I ask you something? What's, what's, what do you have to pay for when it comes to distribution these, these companies put out? What's the money for you got to pay for? Just so I, I think that's I, the dark love into yeah. it. That's dark. See, dark lo- see that's what I'm saying. People, yeah. you got to look at everything as not just one lane. Everything is very big. What I'm saying is the, the Dark small Love print. album. You got to look at the small print. Album. Yeah, like the Dark Love album is that. It's to show you all those realms. It was a Dark Love finding a distribution company to go through. Right. Because I kept mm-hmm. trying to go through um, Ditto. But I kept coming up these like these reviews were just mm-hmm. horrible, just right. bad. Like cats weren't able to get like if you got a song on Spotify and it got up to I don't know, let's say a few hundred thousand views. Yeah, yeah, you, get paid, you was yeah. getting a letter from Spotify saying that all of a sudden your song and it's like, well, I distribute. Th- it's weird. That's what you put it on there for. Yeah, and so a lot of them, I, I, I a lot of them be kind of weird too. Yeah, though. yeah. Seeing that back me up on it, I was like, I don't think I want to test that. I don't want to go through that headache. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? Distro Kid, I heard a lot of great things about. Also, you know what I mean? I, I think it actually helped a lot of artists, and it works great. You know, as far as percentages and things like that. But that was the dark love into it, finding like. Uh, I want to do this, but I don't want to do that. You know yeah. what I mean? But and then when it anyway. comes to stuff like that, you don't want to be, ha- you don't want to have to put it on this platform, put it on this platform, put it on this platform. Right, right. You, right. Go, you just want to put it on one. Distro, right. They gonna knock out right. everything for you. So right, that's why right. it, it helps a lot. So so, well, so, well, so one, uh, this, I, I'm 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 foreign to the whole music game. So mm-hmm. one company. They could do all of it for you. I'm is one company. Uh, one social media company? wise, like as far as media, media wise, like right. it could go YouTube, SoundCloud, Spotify, Tidal, okay, in that nature. So they could, they all you had to do is put it on DistroKid, and they're gonna distribute it, uh, distribute Come it, more to the mic. Nice, distribute nice, it nice. in all fashions, all s- social media. Then you okay. get a PR. A PR is to get you in position in the right buildings and and you know meetings and stuff like that so you just need all that when you're trying to push a project sure, get out there. right so and so that's is like stream, is streaming is people is this new game right now everybody making money streaming records um, right now i feel if you don't if you if artists did their things right like copyright their music first mm-hmm. and then they published it with the nascap or bmi company or i mean and do sound exchange mm-hmm. and then from there because sound exchange watches all your di- digital work right. so if your song goes big on soundcloud and it does a hundred thousand views sound exchange will collect that dough for you and send you your money you right. know what i mean um i feel like a lot of artists aren't looking at those things um even this helps a lot of poets th- this helps a lot of musicians this helps a lot of people who just starting out and don't know what they want to yeah. do with the music or you know, whatever type of artistry you have, these yeah. platforms are great for you. So that's, you know, that's what I was finding out. You know, I mean, that's what company I ended up going with was, you know, Distro. Uh, yeah, that's, and what, so, that's what I plan on uh, yeah. releasing okay. Chapter 29. Yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm yeah. going to do Distro. So, I mean, support your local businesses, people. Yes, sir. Please. It's, it's worth it, though, for music. Man, so, we work yeah. hard for it, man. So let me ask you this question, because I, I know, like, uh, you mentioned BMI. And uh, I, I just chose. That's why I chose to just play independent artist music because BMI has a contract with Facebook. So you know when you play music and it comes up like 
your but, video has been partially muted because of this song. Yeah. And BMI, now I don't know about the artist side, but for a radio station, you pay about five hundred dollars a year just to play music, and then you gotta you gotta keep notes of how many times you play somebody's song. And that's on BMI, right? Yeah. Right. Yeah. They, okay, they make so, it real tedious for for radio stations. You know. Okay. What I'm saying? So I say, <clears throat> if I was told from my experience of from being twelve years old doing this to, I'm over thirty now. I'm not a granddaddy, but I would say it's best to go with ASCAP because ASCAP is not only gonna watch the things that you're not looking at, um, they're gonna help you on other avenues as far as uh, information, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Knowing how to go about getting certain things. And there are some avenues that BMI have that I'm not aware of, you know what I mean? But I'm a ASCAP, I've been with ASCAP since I was 16 years old. Yeah, so, I, I got both. I got yeah. one as a writer and then one as an artist. But the one that paid off, the one that paid off was ASCAP. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie, I, I would, you know, Thank you, ASCAP. The checks to come in on time. Huh? Thank you. I appreciate y'all. <laughs> yeah. Well, 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 they've been a little delayed because of this corona, and that yeah. was weird, too. Because I know if I got affected, I know a lot of big, uh, you know, big artists bro, got affected. You know what I mean? They are hurt it's, right bro. now. Like, <laughs> can, can, can I, can I actually, this, ask you guys, because you just guys do music, and, and I know that, you know, you make money streaming online, but don't you make uh, just as much money touring? You make more money, I think, I think touring, touring. Depending on what type of artist you are. Yeah. Like in that in that form, if you a big uh, high commodity A list artist, then your bag just to come out is gonna be ridiculous. okay. So paint this in more of a picture. So the topic is dark love. I have an album coming out, dark love. So your experience and what you've been through, how would to me dark love is a love uh, is a beautiful. Um, it's like darkness and greatness at the same time. More. Uh -huh. You know what I mean Evil good Or you know what I mean Whatever yeah. it's, it's the oxymoron What would you say With your experience And his question What would you say Dark love Like this is the dark love I, that I love it But I hate it You know yeah. what I mean I think the And, and, and touring yeah, And the, the benefits the, In touring, the touring And making more money Honestly I haven't Hit no big tour Okay You know what I'm saying So I, I don't know How that How that bag look mm -hmm. But Uh I do. I have been paid for my shows, or whatever the case may be, but you. Look, I see more money in in performing than on my streaming platforms. Okay. So that's. I mean, because the streaming it does. Don't, don't you gotta have the numbers for the yeah. streaming to really you kick ha off? You have to be hitting the pop. Yeah. Yeah. Them okay. hundred thousands, five hundred thousands to really be sitting on something to look at. Like you know what I'm saying. See, I look at it different, and I'm a, and I'm only saying this because I want to help us. This is why this is where we come to filter out all uh, the BS. Okay. Right? We find solutions for it. And I can help you out with that. Yeah. In the sense of imagine you had a hundred people that liked what you do. They mm. love what you do. Right? This is something that y'all can use. Business people, yeah. entrepreneurs, whatever you want to call yourself, y'all can use preach. this model. Say that. You preach. can take a hundred people who love what you do. Who said I don't mind spending twenty five dollars on whatever product he come out with? Yeah, right. He take a hundred people, and how much cash is that? It's enough. It's twenty five, right? So if you can take that and multiply that across the country, you know what I mean? So you need a hundred everywhere. But yeah, but at the but same time, you core. still need numbers to to make that calculate. Yeah, you to no, you money. don't. You need a hundred people. People, you go to ten okay, so spots. How, so how do you, you go to ten spots? Okay, to multiply. Ten need a spots. core fan base. Exactly. So okay. tell me, tell me how to do it so I can know, like understand. I would say if I because uh, you can do I, that here in L.A. Okay, so what for a comedian, do that else? all right, I'm gonna take myself out the picture and make myself a comedian, right? Go for As it. As a comedian, mm -hmm. I will find a hundred people in Cali who likes what I do. Mm -hmm. I will find a hundred people in Vegas who loves what I do. Absolutely. I'll find a hundred people in so and so in Oregon, in Nashville, and wherever you know what I mean. In Bovagado, I don't give a damn. You know what I mean. I will find these people. People don't understand that there are small towns in America that does not have any talent. Like they don't have no great yeah, talent going on. There. They got right. grinders though. They got grinders. They got grinders. They're local grinders. People. What but is a grinder? A grinder because you ain't gotta have no talent at all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You ain't gotta I, I, have no talent. You absolutely. Feel me? But if you got a whole favorite, yeah. yeah. But if you got a push behind you, like if you got ten people that's gonna be solid with you, you got yeah. five people that's gonna promote. Five other people that's gonna do all you need is a you feel me <laughs> or, or a structure or you got the drug that is money behind you do yeah. sell dope 
behind oh, you. Come on, pushing man. you. It's you over. Out of here. He gonna make his money back. You out of here. He pushing you. If Fast, you just, he gotta make his bread. That's because then you yeah. gonna have your once you get your community, they don't even gotta fuck with you. They could just fuck with the person that they actually, absolutely. You know what I mean? Well, that's what I'm saying, people. We absolutely. have to. What I'm saying, growing is a community, and comedy and music are different too. That's what someone just commented on our post. Um, but absolutely. we have to find a community, and what we're talking about right now, I'm people. Who are these gentlemen? Um, said topic. That. We haven't got to our main topic, but right now we're just talking about. You know, um, touring and, you know, the great benefits of having, you know, um, artistry. But mm -hmm. being a musician across the country and what is the dark love in that? And um, dark love is an oxymoron. It's something you hate, which you love at the same time. It's like a, a bittersweet relationship that you can't leave in, in a way. That's what music is to me, you know what I mean? And that's why I wanted to expound more on the dark love sense and to kind of elevate, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. I mean, because me, I know you write all the time. Yeah, I'm always your Instagram writing. is lit. Yeah, like I'm always writing, bro. I'm always cooking, but I just but I don't put myself in a box. You get what I'm saying? Right, so I don't right. genre. I don't genre my music. Like you get what I'm saying? Like it's D Jamal, nigga. <laughs> right, <laughs> well, you you turn it off. Right. Yeah. yeah, period. What bro. you hate about it? What you hate about the love that you you have for music? Like you, you can't leave it. Yeah, it's 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 bittersweet. It's like it's like you love it, but you know it, it's it's kind of like you see what other people are gravitated to. Right. And it's trash to me. <laughs> like to me, it's like it's like all I gotta do is tell you how many people I've seen shot or right, how many right. drug deals I've seen done right, or right. done whatever. But the case. And, and that gets boring after a it's while. It's like, bro, after your after your sixteen bars, I don't care about your hook anymore because it's just, just like I'm. I feel acquitted. I feel like you about to get me right, again. Right, 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 <laughs> you know what right, I'm saying? Right. So it's like boring. So I I don't I don't deal with that. So I hate the trend. I hate the trendiness of music now. True. Okay. Yeah, true. it's like that's the dark love. How how it's so fabric. It's like over. But you can't leave it. I can't. But so because you so love I, it so much. Like, yeah. So I stick to my guns. You get right. what I'm saying? People, and people follow DJ Jamal on yeah. Instagram. Everyone, go check out his music Please. and all that you say, great you stuff. You saying you say you basically do you. You ain't got to worry about nobody else. Yeah. Because your thing happen. Yeah. When I perform, bro. I don't give a damn where I am. I'm taking the crowd with Yeah, me. you are lit. Like, yeah, yeah. Like, I don't care. Yeah, bro. I gotta get like, you the facts. Play, I gotta get your yeah. playground show. Facts. On me, bro. Yeah. So it's like, I'll, I'll, I'll bring a show regardless. Cause what about love. motivational music? Motivational, like, like uh motivational music like it give me a, a little like some kanye mix with right right King, like, we heard, Lamar, like someone said Kendrick, we need more Cole. music we need yeah, exactly. someone just said we need more motivational music that's a fact facts, facts. that's, that's true. a fact but see it's, I, it's a thin line between that i feel you can't I, go I have, a, I have a i have a i have a very motivational thing but then it's like i grew up in church all my life facts. so I could be very motivation. I could give you the motivation, but, but are you gonna why, receive no, no, it? No, no, are you no, gonna no. receive it? But why it? does the motivation have to be like a gospel record? Because it don't have, have to. It doesn't have that's to. What, that's be, what he relate with, though. That's that's where yo, that's where it's from. Yeah, uh, regardless of regardless of anything, a true feeling is inside. Yo, that is a gospel. That's a that's a, that is church right here. If this that's is, what he feels, this of course. is church. You feel me? So Go if I, if I, so if you would use God as yeah. the motivational. Yes. Okay. Of course. That's what you're saying. You, okay. Of I got course. You. Off time. I mean, because that's what gets him through what he got to do most of the time. Correct. Straight up. Yeah. And you have to, you have to be real full of self. Like right. I'm not full of shit though, but <laughs> full, of, full of like full of self. I like that. Like, I like you that. know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Like you have to know yourself. You have to know your flaws. Respect your flaws, just like your advantages. Own it. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? It, so yeah. once you get once you get comfortable with yourself, life life start weeding. Like things just start weeding itself out. That's so there. true, bro. Yeah, that's you know so what I'm true. saying? Especially when you're trying to come come back, get your life right. Yeah, and, and that's what the music. That's what the, that's the dark love because you're going through all the in betweens while you try to you know what i mean make your diamond or yeah. turn into a butterfly or whatever the case may be just that transitional stage yeah. like you yeah. know what i mean I, I feel as an artist you gotta be real with yourself man Straight i feel up. like you gotta be real with yourself if you ain't real with yourself no one's gonna believe whatever you putting out right you see what i'm saying so if you're going through something and you feel in your heart you want to motivate somebody people go feel that yeah if you're just doing it just because like man 
You yeah. can't feel that right there. And they going to bite it as soon as you, like, what you put out, yes, they going to nip it. They, 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 what your mom, what, what yeah. your mom say, you give yeah. them enough rope, they going to yeah. hang themselves. Niggas is jumping off the bridge, bro. Right. Absolutely. Right. Right. <laughs> Absolutely. That's the dark love, Absolutely. man. Like, For real. That's how, that's how I've been, like, really kind of management, like, staying together, man, is from not jumping off the bridge. You see like, what Lakeisha said right there? You know what I mean? Uh, Lakeisha or Sean said, but your audience relate you we'll flip flop. Well, but will your audience relate to your you, you oh, to your flip flopping? Of course. What, what of course. Do you mean? I mean, uh, what she mean? Okay, if you're doing hip hop, you're doing street stuff, you're doing your block stuff. Will you your audience it, relate to all those things? It's not doing so different because yeah. it's me. I'm not. I ain't, I'm That's not true. put. I'm not pr in no persona being no the super is gangster. I'm not pr in a, in this big fake world, man. All this stuff that y'all see. Niggas with guns on cameras and all this, that's fake. If you really got Absolutely. it and you really bout that life, you're not talking about it, bro. Like, this is like, people are so bamboozled with the just know, the them simple. Are, them comment. Haitians over in Florida is pretty. Well, 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 I mean, well, come I, on, bro. I, 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 but, <laughs> I, but also, also, I also think, honestly, I think, honestly, when dudes put guns and shit like that online, it's an insecurity because you don't think people believe you hard. Man, that's so like. You go, Bump that online and shit. You know, that's what I'm like niggas that be real weenies, but they got a bunch of face tattoos. Like a nigga not gonna punch you still. Yeah, like absolutely. that doesn't mean anything. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like that doesn't. I get you. That's real I shit. Get you. you know what I'm I saying? It's like bullshit. Like that, you know what I mean? That's real shit. That's that's, real that's shit. what would you say about you? I mean, I want to spend a little bit, maybe thirty seconds more on dark love for comedy. Like, what would you say would be your bittersweet and uh, my bittersweet? My bittersweet is um in comedy. Just relate with people, man. Uh, uh, not second guessing. With first of all, with comedy, you cannot give a fuck what you say. Yeah, you see what I'm saying. Sometimes as artists, we we like we we want to put something out. Right. We scared of being judged about right. it. Right. You see what I'm saying. We scared yeah. being judged. What people go right. think about us and stuff like that. But that's like new. That's that's it's kind of like new school. What up, fellas? Yeah. But new, but you know school. what though? I, you know what? Being a comedian ain't like it used to be because. You know, look look what they did to Kevin Hart. Some jokes uh, ten years ago absolutely. about mm -hmm. homosexuality. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? So it's like now everybody want to get all sensitive because you're cracking jokes. Mm -hmm. I mean, comedians talk about everybody and anybody. We're going but now it. all of a sudden, certain communities want to be all sensitive and they want to ban you, but, and they can do it because they the ones who run that network. Yeah, yeah well, it's not the comedians. I think there's too it's, many it's, females it's, it's, walking it's a, it's around here. It's social media, a lot of sensitive people. <laughs> it's that person <laughs> that's your, what you say? You got what I said? It's a what? You caught me. I think it's too many females walking around here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And are, are you, are you referring to the Mitches? Uh, <laughs> Mitches, right? The Mitches, Mitches right? right? The Mitches. Let me, let me, let me rephrase that. The Mitches. A lot of Mitches <laughs> walking around here. But, but also, oh, also, but also, it's that person but on, on, behind a the computer. <laughs> they don't do shit. <laughs> <laughs> so short I'm person. Sorry about that. He, he started Mitches. shit already, ain't he? Mitches. I'm starting. I, hey, you don't know me. I, I told three. I like to I told air three it out. This watch the show. I told three to watch the show tonight. Yeah, I hope a preacher do watch watch this show tonight. You know what I mean? So, um. To, that's Dark Love, everyone. You know what I mean? Y'all go check out that. It's Round coming out in a few days. Sure, right sure, that. Yeah. It's going to be real yeah. nice. Trust, it's going gonna, it's gonna to surprise you. Uh, it's a little different from what you know, you've know you mostly heard from Piers on the Heartbreak Hotel album, um, which was released uh, maybe a year ago. But um, anyway, so our next thing is... The Black um, Doctor? Huh? Was it The Black Doctor? I was gonna do is it well yeah, yeah we could do the black dot. Oh, you want to do the party celebrations eating out? Yeah, something about that. Yeah, yeah talking about that. Sir. Yeah. What the going out? Yeah, going out thing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't so, so, do it. I, exactly. So <laughs> I, thank you, brother. So what's going on right now? A lot of a lot of a lot of states. Let me just Ooh, state it right now. Yeah. A lot of the states has passed a law to open up barbershops, right? Restaurants, right? All the, know, all, uh, all the all the crazy nail stuff. salons, nail salons, and this is in Georgia. Yes, in Georgia. And then, but also too, I think it's in thirty-one states now. I believe thirty-one states are now uh, considering reopening all. Uh, I mean, they're talking about elementary schools going to uh, having food inside the classrooms. Yeah, yeah, it's, you know it's, it's bullshit. And also, oh, too, no Vegas, Vegas will open up the casinos again. Oh man, that's gonna it's be a lot, lot of bullshit. Y'all are about to be lab rats. Word. Absolutely, <laughs> this is a guinea pig. 
Like Preach, this bro. is Preach some you, bro. bullshit, bro. If you gon' if I don't care what you do as an adult, but if you bags. have if you have kids, where re I repeat, if you have children, man, I'm talking about eighteen on down. They steal your kids. Right. Don't send them to no school, big dog. No, no. Whoa, 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 whoa. school 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 is done for a minute. California, school is done for yeah, a minute. California, yeah, they, school ain't coming back until Cali. August. No, 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 which I want I want to kind of tap into that too. You know what I'm saying? But no. the but, governor of Cali is not allowing any uh, the bad true. bull. You know yeah, I mean? yeah, he ain't allowed. Um, none but, of that. But, you know I mean? but, but, but the thing they are the, considering the, the, in other states that the, no fast, they should reopen sure. schools. You know. But the thing the thing about it right now too, yo, we understand that. I'm saying right now. If you understand what's going on, the hair salons, the barber shops, certain restaurants, that's what black people go to, yo. Yeah, just you know the black saying? corona people. That's the black people go to. We already the number one race dying for the coronavirus right now. Yeah, number 54%. one race. Come yes. On. Race. 54%. You know what I'm saying? Come on. If it's if it's heart disease, diabetes, high cholesterol, you might have be cancer, whatever the case may be, we the ones that's dying from it. Yeah. Right. So the government say, you know what, we go we go just get get it all to y'all. We go open Preach. this up for y'all. Well, we well, gonna get it all to y'all. Well, well, we well, let y'all kill y'all well, well. <laughs> Because they try to get rid of us anyway. You know what I'm saying? I put the government try to get rid of us or just do some type of I mean, just cut on, back in the society. It. Bro, fifty four percent. You already know what and it is. And me and Phil was talking about that earlier. Yeah. He was telling me he was like, "Well, we we really can't look at the statistics level." And I'm like, Man. "Yeah, you're right Facts. because a lot of those yeah. are fabricated because they're giving anybody who go into the hospital the corona now. Yeah, uh, yeah. Uh, Yo. Your leg hurt? Ah, uh, broken yeah, leg. Corona, sure. corona yeah. did it. Corona broke his leg." And that's why he's in it. We got to give him uh, some antibiotics. For sure. Let me let me let me let me, let me tell you something. Sure. Now they give you a treatment and you and yeah. you die from a treatment. And, and they said that the, the girl now. went to the to the hospital. She said I didn't have no 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 symptoms or nothing like that. All of a sudden. Yeah, boom! They said, "Oh, COVID." That was her, you know, what I'm saying diagnosis or whatever the case may be. Like, come on, dog. Yo, nah. that's what happened to my uncle. Yo, my uncle said he's breathing real hard. Right. He just. He an athlete, first of all. Damn. He was breathing real hard. Shit wasn't right. He kept, he kept coughing, and it was kind of crazy. Damn. He went to go get a test. After the test, he felt worse, bro. See, that's what I'm talking about. He felt that, worse. That's what I'm talking about. He felt worse. That's what I'm so I'm telling you right now, it's something else going on right hey, now. We don't we don't understand, yo, people, behind closed doors. People, there's real. a video going around where a doctor is talking about the ventilators and the symptoms that if you're coming into the hospital with, yeah. that they're giving you a a a uh, um, COVID care system or formula, whatever they give you, like which making the patient more sicker. That's now, like, I don't know. It's like that the, vaccine. It's a vaccine, pretty much, is what they're saying. They, 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 this is a new way to test out the new vaccines, people. I ain't gonna lie, I'm too scary for that shit, bro. You not? We you all not, scared right now. I'm just saying. Low what you hey, the best thing I'm just saying. If you not gonna take the vaccine all on your own, then you catch COVID and you go into the hospital. You know what I mean? Like a call little. your oldest Come woman on, in your family. Call Stay the home. oldest woman in your family Stay and home. learn. The remedies, bro. Yes, learn. absolutely. That's what I've been Call saying. Call your grandma. Yeah, she know like, everything. Learn make you your safe, remedies. Yo. Please share this podcast, everyone. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. See, I'm, I'm, I'm listening to y'all. See, I have a whole different perspective because uh, uh -oh. I, I just don't see. We run The whole thing is the government has never been straightforward with us, period. Never gonna yeah. be. Absolutely. Tell never assassination. Gonna be tell a, uh, uh, anything with the Holocaust, with slavery, with anything. Wow. I guarantee you're not going to get the truth. So when I say don't get caught up into the numbers, because I love numbers, what I'm saying to you is when it comes to blacks, the numbers is always greater. Mm -hmm. If you Absolutely. live in Los Angeles and you live in a community that's 89% black, 89% mm -hmm. black. Where? I'm just saying, if no, you, no, if this is just, if, hypothetical. Every, every, yeah. Just okay. Period, period. And if there are 100 cases, so there's 100 cases and it's 89% black. Come on, man. Of course the number is going to be higher because the majority of that community is black or that state is black. Mm. Now, I'm not excusing those who've gotten sick and those who've died. I know people who have had corona and didn't even know they had corona and was sick and went through the whole process. Now, this was back in December, and I was with this brother. I did not get it. Now, I'm not saying I'm immune. What I'm saying is, you immune. We talking about everything else. <laughs> but well, maybe you had we, corona, bro. You, maybe you maybe I have. Maybe I'm a you, you, was you a symptom. You don't symptoms. I, You're a gangster. But what yeah. I'm saying is, if you take care of your damn <laughs> you self, yeah. Because corona is just a higher 
it's like the flu on steroids. Right. Absolutely. All my I, research I agree, I agree. goes back to every single symptom of the flu. Most people don't know flus come in DNA. The coronavirus is RNA. What is RNA? That's animal gene. Right. So therefore, exactly. it's been created somewhere in the lab. I believe most people have had it. Okay. And if, went through it already. I, I, I agree. I say, agree. Okay, so if you're going to say it's been put in the lab, to give you some kudos to your nice president, he's now going at uh, China because he's saying China came up with this and they did it now. Captain, when Owen. the same guy was yeah. telling us to put disinfectant inside of our body and stick, but he was saying that he was saying it being real <laughs> humorous and, and anal, man. But, 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 you know, he said stupid shit. He, 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 he was, like, he was not hustler, bro. What he's, he's hustler, really bro. trying to make you understand is the shit is not as serious as other people's trying to make it. That's what he's really saying. He's being angry. He's never gotten up there and had a mask on. I got a video in my inbox where they're in that same room and a guy walking around with a mask on. I'm sure y'all seen it. And right. the other politician walk in right. and say, hey, why you still got your mask on? You do know this is a hoax, right? Whoa. Mm, right? Yeah, for yeah, for real. Send it yeah, for to real. me. And I'm sitting here like. Gas mask tribe, it's people. Hope. It's a hope. You only gotta get it in. We give y'all the truth, y'all. We give y'all the truth. So for me, like I said, I'm not saying that no, coronavirus don't go, no, don't is just not pass real. Over that like we didn't hear that. No, no, no. I'm, I'm gonna pull Rewind. it up for you Say if I can again. find it. Say but what I, no, I'm gonna pull it up that way y'all can hear them. Uh, but what I'm saying is, I don't want people to think that uh, Doctor Field is saying the coronavirus is a host. What I'm saying is, it is the, it is the flu on steroids. Mm -hmm. Coronavirus has yet to kill as many people as the flu. Right. It has yet to kill that. I, I give you that. It's only sixty thousand. But you see what I'm saying? But right, it's only but, 60, but I can ask you a question though. That's okay, a I, lot I, of I, I feel you on I feel you on that, but listen up, y'all. I feel you on that. But we haven't had a cure for it though. Okay? Flu, we don't have a cure for flu. You, you, you We don't. We have it. a vaccine. Most people who take the vaccine end up with the flu anyway. Exactly. But no, no, that's the cold that's the clue. That's the cold <laughs> thing. No, right listen, there. flu, yes, a sir. regular cold, pneumonia, all of them is related, bruh. Okay, facts though. But if people, I mean, I honestly, if people do die from the the flu. Yeah, the flu and shit. But if we don't know what's going on, how are we supposed to prepare for it, though? That's my thing right now. We can't just say fuck it. No, no, I'm not you know saying, saying that. that. What I'm saying to you is, okay. How do let's, we prepare say, for it? How do we say, prepare yeah, for it? You said, how do, how do we prepare that, for okay, it? Okay, wait, listen. Supplements you said 60,000 has died from it, right? That's what you said, 60,000. Right, 60, okay, how, black. how many has had it? Has had it? Uh, a okay, million, so no, no, over, no, no, over, over a million, over, over a million. million. Yeah, okay. sure. Wait, wait, listen though. In, in United States, yeah. Hear, hear what you're saying. Yeah, you said over a million has had it. So, what does that say? There's nine hundred and forty thousand. That can that can that's revive. been healed. Or that they send. So wait a minute. Or, wait or a minute. not be healed. Or they listen. Just... Let me use your number. Sixty thousand. It's ten ten point seven million people in Los Angeles. 60,000 of 10.7 million is 0.0.1 percent. Talk to me, man. Come on, now. Y'all got to do the numbers. So it's okay to it's only like, It's like, what, 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 5 so percent people? No, I, no. I get you. 0.0. So you lost a tenth percent. of people. That's all right. It's, it's what that has it. If you go, if you, listen, 10 percent of a million okay, is 100,000. Okay. So you need a million to make 10 percent of 10 million. Mm -hmm. So when you're talking about a couple of hundred people, couple hundred thousand people who's had it no, we haven't even got into the two percent or the one percent facts that's facts that's facts so that's what that's i'm facts. saying is it is serious but again a lot of people is just taking their regular vitamins but that you supposed to take your vitamins and all that that's anyway. what i'm saying you build your immune saying. system that's all i've been doing uh, uh, me too me too you gotta do that but i think people is i think people is not really Interested in the well, 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 well. in in right. the number factor. I just really people feel people are kind of like freaked out and just need to, you know, what I mean, find a way to uh, take care of their bodies now. You know, what I mean, absolutely. I, I think it's, we should take care of ourselves. It's a community it's, thing. It's really a community. It takes a community. If we take care of our bodies, stay in our homes. I don't think it's safe to go in the to any damn salon or uh, hey, where the hell elementary I, I, school. I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't even say the come community. on, really? I, I, where are we going? going? I, I wouldn't say the community. It takes the individual, yo. Do you, yo? Say, until the death man. rate, until the death rate is like zero. Do, yeah. And then you know, I I think it's all right. Well, well, I, I think it's I, gonna, I, people I, gonna keep dying though, bro. It's like no, I'm talking. But, but, but okay, honestly, I get you. Like, honestly, I get anybody you. else can get corona and die right now. Okay, honestly, you know, say if but I'm the corona is but they right. What I'm saying is they're saying that anybody have the corona now. They're not even like. 
like you could come in there with a freaking broken finger or uh, 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 oh my fingernail hurt um, I need to come get a doctor <laughs> and they giving niggas oh he got the corona you know what I mean he got that okay, wrong look yeah, <laughs> look a man died of a heart attack these numbers uh, 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 look a man died of a heart attack a heart attack they gonna add that in the no they're they not going to they did this and his wife went public and said no he had a heart attack another woman this died of a stroke yes they labeled as coronavirus she nice. went viral a girl had a baby early premature they said that baby died from corona all right now y'all forcing shit like y'all doing yeah, y'all doing a little bit saying? too much now where everything, everything okay I saw, can i ask you a question so is that not fake that if you do have a, a pre-existing thing going on with you it, i believe that's corona, true i mean that's what that's you, what just about everything but that's, it, but that, that's your body period if you have something right. already going on with your body of course your immune system is going to be your immune system is compromised yeah, right, right. Yeah. You know so I mean? people to sum all this up we have to take care of our immune system we have to eat our vitamins as what they mentioned earlier um Please, please, if you can exercise inside your home, that would be great instead of going out. Exercise. There was a sign, I believe, yes, in sir. Beverly Hills. There was a sign that said, put on your effing mask. You know what I mean? And I'm like, wow. I tell, I, tell dudes, <laughs> I tell dudes. I tell dudes. I tell dudes. And they were jogging, some yeah. joggers or whatever. But I, I, I just, I, take care of yourself, people. Yeah, I tell dudes and females, like, honestly, strap up. Like, you don't want to go wrong. <laughs> hey, okay? That's facts. Okay? Facts. I'll put this on my Facebook page. Going what? outside while a mask is like going raw. I said going outside that's like going raw. Like true what? facts, okay? So strap up, strap up. after you going on some brand new coochie. Put the helmet put on. Put your shit on, what? okay? It's a new relationship. It's a one night stand. Put your mask on. You just met Corona. Put your mask on, people. Corona. Strap up, baby. What about Corona? Y'all better watch out for Corona. How you look? Oh, strap up. You know I mean? Coroniana, you. Yeah, yeah. Coroniana <laughs> from where? Hey, where she from? Uh, she, uh, she from the valley? She got it, man. <laughs> 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 That's the question. So, <laughs> hey, man, we want to get into uh, DJ Mall, man. We want to expound on you a, little, uh, a lot more. And um, there were some questions. Maybe we can go back and forth if you want. Maybe, you know what I mean? Or whatever. You got to create a game sometimes, too, bro. Huh? I just thought about a game. You can stop playing with the artists and shit. Right, right. But, uh, right actually, right, how, how long have right. you been doing your thing, though, for, bro? Uh, I've been serious since I was 19. So. Like 10, to the mic. Speaking to the mind. Ten years. So cool as shit. Ten, ten years. Seriously, shit, I've been you, doing. You only music. look nineteen. What do you mean? Exactly. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you know, that, you know, got that youth vibe working God for is you. Good. You feel me? All the time. Yeah, yeah. Straight up. Who but your yeah. music? Uh, who your music idols? Uh, Jay Z. Off top. Why? Uh, lyrical wordplay, man. Okay. Who uh, next? Andre three thousand wordplay. Why? Oh wow! Okay. You know what I'm He's saying? Nice too. Crazy, and then you know, growing up in Long Beach, of course, I gotta say Snoop and the East Side is like just being yeah. by East being by VIP. I used to live right around the corner. Like I was the low rider bike kid. You know what I'm saying? I was I was one of them. You feel me? So you can't go wrong. You feel me? Then having moms moms did R and B and shit. So you get the oh, shot. So family already. Yeah, yeah, you get yeah. the shot the, the yeah, floor bro. trees and like the pen got to be cold. Like you know what I'm okay. saying? I'm a cold Anita Baker. Like I go, I go there. Now that's like, my girl right there. Yeah, yeah. she cold. So you have a wide range of some, uh, some, 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 you know, some musical idols. I, I love that you name people that's not from the West Coast. Right. I love that. Yeah, don't joke outside the box. Yeah. What's um? Why your sound is different, bro? Why? Why you pick your sound? Why you you? Cause God made me this way, like you know what I mean. I I uh, like I said, I don't put myself in a box. So I always I love to test my writing capability. So if I been writing too quick of a R and B song or two, the verses just coming to, I sometimes I get into a vibe. It's just it's going. You know what I'm saying? All right, let me do an R and B joint. Let me do a neo soul joint right quick. Let me just step back. So that's why I always push on sound like y'all. You know? So do you ever go with? As a thought, this is just a thought. Do you ever go with what people like more of your fan base? Do what they like more, or you just do? I've you? been, I've, I've been getting into listening to my fans lately. Right. You know what I'm saying? I, I really was like I said in the in earlier. It was about learning myself. Like I had to learn just me, Love not it. only me as a human, but me as an artist right. and a man, and just 
you know, going in that. Okay. That's what so, can I ask a question? Do you can see? I was asked West Coast artists, East Coast artists, even cats from Midwest. Do you consider yourself a West Coast artist? Or do you consider yourself an artist where everybody can relate and understand? Do you talk about music? I'm, you know, you got you, you to gotta be careful how you answer this. I'm a West Coast. You, hold on, listen. You got to be careful because you I'm know West, West Coast. I'm a West Coast artist. Hold on, wait. Okay. But I'm very well seasoned. Okay. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nice to put. Nice to put. Like, like, like you know yeah. what I'm saying? You just not going to put, you know, garlic, salt, and pepper on me. You know what I'm saying? Right, we don't yeah. have to, you know, get your Kanye's and your curries up right, and right, all right, that. Right, you know right. what I mean? Absolutely. So. You gonna bring it? That's what's yeah. I like. That. I like that, brother. I like that. That was, that was yeah. a good ass answer, though, bro. Yeah, yeah, I think represent, that. but everybody gonna love on shit. How yeah. can you? I mean, this is a big one for me. I like to ask artists, how can their music help humanity? Like, how can your music help others? Well, my grandmother used to always ask me when I first started, for real, for real. She used to always say, like, if you was, if if it was a battle between who you win and the soul for. Mm. Who would you Who would you be winning the soul for? So repeat uh, that again, because I don't think the audience even picked yeah. up. So on my that. my grandmother used to say, if you if it was a battle on who you gonna win the soul for, are you gonna be winning it for the higher power, or are you gonna be winning it for the the wrong? The, okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't want to put the names on it and all that, but I I I, I want to push the life and love, like you know okay. what I'm saying. Of course, I've been through. Trials and tribulations, you know what I'm saying. So if I'm listening to a DJ Mar record, you gonna learn some shit. I'm gonna learn something, <laughs> and I'm gonna feel, I'm gonna feel empowered for you know sure. I mean? like, and then if it, it depends on what song you put on, because then I might be super empowering on one, and then two shots or three shots of Henny, I might be trying Gangsta. to talk to some some. Uh, I'll be on the hoes. I'll be on the chicks. You feel me? <laughs> And then you facts, know, facts. depending on the temperature, I'm always I'm a I always I'm a adapt type of person. So I adapt. So if it's right. a, a room full of wolves, I'm a wolf. Right, you know what right, I'm saying? Right. If it's chill, then I'm chilling. I'm playing that, life that, in a party. I that just facts. Into, I like that, bro. I that like brings that. me into my next one, um, which was your ideal fan. Like, who would listen to your music? An open-minded person. Someone that's not stuck into the box. A person okay, that cool. asks questions on on typical logic. Okay, but is this person okay, that's a very broad that's very broad, but is this person a person that works every day or they a person that I mean like give me yeah. the life of your ideal fan that listens to D Jamal. My ideal fan is from all shape forms. I don't care if you don't work, I don't care if you work, it's just the way that you think. Right. It's uh it's more on the like I'm, I'm big on I'm big on self love, bro. It's right. like how if you Facts. if you trying to grow, if you trying to make a a a, a change in your life, right. if you you know what I'm saying you you see people because things once once you change in music and just in life, everything around you change. So I want that person in that transition. I want I want that person that's really trying to figure it you out. Need that like, motivation. Right. Yeah, motivation. That, yeah, need right. that kick. You know what I'm saying? Because right. everybody you don't you don't live your your whole 24 hours the same way. Right. Okay. You record know. label signed you. Who would you say they market your music to? Age wise or I don't no. Who would you Who would you say they market your music? A record label signed you, and they say, but we want you to tell us who to market. To put the where to put the money in women, women just give it to the women. I don't give a damn. The niggas ain't gonna buy it if if, if it's in, if it's, if it's <laughs> in a woman facts, if, facts. If, a, if, a, if it's in a woman car, and they vibing and you you didn't got three four. If all you need is a little time, if a right. woman can sit and play your music for 10, 20 minutes, you gotta. It's She's over the, with. All, all girls. It's, it's over so, with. But uh, this question though, are you kidding your music to women though? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, don't, yeah. don't, don't. Oh, no, okay, no, not like, hold on, not, wait. Not like that. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. I understand. Wait, wait, wait. I think we put him up against not the like wall. That. Wait, I think not like that. Not like that, but I gotta get it. <laughs> like. <laughs> Thugs ain't listen to your music. No, nah, nigga, that nigga too, that nigga too, that nigga too soft. Nah, cause look, cause women listen to the shit. It's, 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 uh. It's different type of it's different type of DJ Malls you get. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, you know what I'm saying? You might get DJ Mall. DJ Mall is the more mature, you know what I'm saying, trying to get his, you know, 
getting it together. Yeah, yeah. But I, my name used to be Reckless. Right, Reckless. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, so I, oh, might, wow. I might come in this motherfucker, on, you know what I'm saying? I'm of still course. on my growth, but I still got to have a little fun here and there, you right. know what I'm right. saying? Facts, right. facts, 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 right. facts, facts, facts. You know, it's just What up, what were you feeling you, you going through, you talk about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, yeah. would you sign a 360 deal? Which of which of top three labels you would like to get signed to? Before we even talk about the three sixty, top three labels. I need them quick in ten seconds. Quality control. Okay, one. Just to be the only nigga like me over there. Okay, one. Quality control, and uh, they have who on there? Don't matter. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, he want no quality it, control. He, he want that attention. He want that attention. Okay. Yeah. yeah. QCs. Uh, you know, what I mean? they, they, they they booming. They yeah, booming right me. now. Q Dreamville, says, I'll, I'll, Dreamville. I'll fuck with Dreamville. Okay, Dreamville. And I gotta go TDE. For TDE. Sure. Okay, so uh, uh, are these so, all these labels? Yeah, these are well. These are more subsidiary Interscope? labels. Okay, Wait, but before, these are, before, these are, before right, you talking keep about going, though, you got to talk to us non-musical people. What the hell is a 360 deal? Right, right, right. I'm, I, I, oh. I, right, right, right. I'm gonna get to that. I'm gonna get to that. I'm gonna get to <laughs> the 360 deal. Do you know what 360 deal, deal is, though? Yes. Yeah, oh, I'm gonna yes. get to that. I'm gonna get we to that. Act what a three? Oh, okay. Like, uh, okay. You so you, you like LL Cool J? Which I, I, I would not agree with that shit. No, you talk that. I'm gonna tell you what my perspective when you finish though. So, uh, uh, Charlotte Garcia said, we will pay for greatness, and you're right. Thank you so much. I know y'all will. I know great women will pay for greatness. They don't care about, like, yeah. you know what I mean? If it sounds good and it's appealing and, it, yeah. and they relate to it, they'll vibe to they it. Vibe. But, yeah. okay, and so you back to- you gotta be a little cool. You gotta have a conversation. Like, if you, right. if you rapping and, you feel me, you have to know how to explain it for a woman to- Get it, grab it, yeah. Right, Cause right. she hear, oh, what's up, baby? You bad? Oh, right, she right. hear that every day. Right, right, right. You feel me? Right. Uh, you say gorgeous, she fuck around. With it. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! You just say one different word. Yeah, yeah. it's over with. Oh, right. done, that's, that's facts, though. So, that's facts. so that's your facts, three bro. labels you would go to is QC, yeah, TDE, yeah, and Dreamville. Dreamville. Now, those are subsidiary labels oh, yeah. of major labels, but you'd be okay with that, right? Yeah. Now. Would you do a 360? For people who don't know who what a 360 deal, um, 360 deal is where record label make a percentage off of all the income Everything. all the way around. But there's a benefit to this. And before I say this, I want to see if the Jamal answers with the right answer before I end up. So what's the what's the uh, what's the time? Would though? you sign a 360 deal with your three favorite labels? One of them. Yep. Yeah, out of here. Pew. My first couple. You can have this first project because once I get all no, I need. I mean, because you know, three sixty might not go. It might be a three sixty four. Everything. Right, 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 right. But uh, but we talk poor money. Look. Right, they get uh, everything. Look. Let me say. Let me say this. Publishing everything. You can have that shit right now because if I get my foot in, the, I'm a pinky toe in that motherfucker. Oh, you can hear. Yeah. But, 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 but here. Go ahead. Go ahead. Because this is this is like this is powerful to me because this is where I I understand where you're coming from. But you know they say a man in a hard position to make a decision. No, a man. What is it? A man in a bad position makes desperate decisions. That's what it is. I'm not. Exactly. No, look, 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 wait, wait. I that, I because I feel you should only. If you're going to be able to have the benefit of them pushing you into other platforms, exactly. Because that's the that's, only way you going. But that's the only way. If it's not appealing for for it to make sense, I don't. If I'm already getting the offer of the 360 deal, then somebody else is looking. You get what I'm saying? Somebody else is paying attention. So right, right, right. I, I, see, I, 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 I'm gonna tell you from your perspective, bro. And I and I get you. I was there once. You're hungry, bro. You like, nigga, I'm gonna put these work in. <laughs> Run it. Until, bro, you busting your ass and this person don't deserve to get your money. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Sometimes people will give you shit because of your artistry, what you've been doing. Because they know you can get, they know you they can as fuck. Yeah, you dope as fuck. So now, if these these agencies call you, these industries call you just to do this, do that, because yeah. you dope as fuck. Now, you got 360 deal. You got to give this fucking 10, 15%, 20%. All your shit to them when they didn't do shit for you. They but like you. Got you got the machine, 
See, this is. I, th- I, th- I, that's, I, I, I think that's what he's looking at. He's machine. looking at the machine. I'm look, like you can you can listen. Now I know I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose in that. I'm gonna lose that because they're not gonna do one round. album. I hope you know that they're nah, not gonna do one album. Round, they're gonna do at least three albums. That's three to four though, albums. That's fine. That's fine. Well, I say I I wouldn't. I, I, but I, I, I wouldn't want to do the three Before project. I wouldn't want to do the three project joint. Cause that's what they were, that's, that's gonna be, you're, that's you're gonna be heavy. That's gonna be heavy. And definitely, if they put on uh, at least five hundred, uh, five hundred k or more. Oh yeah, we want at least three to four projects. Okay, okay, I, I understand that. They, they, if they paying you shit, but I get my home, Buku? I get this, I get that. that right, right, right. Then I need okay, all that, my that, tour money. It's gonna be conversation. Yeah, it's that, like that it's, that conver- it's conversation See, me, that, that, that you gotta have. Yeah. For for it to make sense in your favor. Okay. For me, I said I get that. The money going to I said if. For me, signing a three sixty would have to be five million up front. But see, listen, you gotta pay that back though, bro. You don't you know got a motherfucking. Did you, you okay, bust your wait, fucking you ass, big ass band? You, 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 you got a you got a big ass band. So you gotta pay so many people, bro. I know the three sixty deal. I've been in that shit, bro. Yo, yes, I've been in that deal. You got a motherfucking whole band, bro. You got a whole band. You gonna have to pay out. Uh-huh. So that's yeah. why you asking for uh-huh. that's why you asking for that. But go ahead and explain uh, yourself. No, you done right. It would be because I know exactly what I need to push it across. With five million, I know they go. Trust me, if I put five million into you, I'm gonna work your ass, nigga, until I could get all my money back and more. You get what I mean? Five, I'm not. Yeah, give me, five hundred thousand and enough me to put five hundred thousand, and I'll never be broke again. But I don't have to really life. do much. I don't give a damn if it's a three sixty deal. I would never ever think about ever, it. A ever label is taking again. you more serious and signing you at a higher price. Yeah, than but that's a label. They're gonna sign you as a label because you're not. You're not. You're not coming as an artist. You're coming as a label. Ding dong, you got it. You know what I mean? You got it, and so that's exactly understand. what I'm saying. Is like that's what. Because you gotta say if they do a three sixty deal with a production label, then it's different. Yeah. It's more of a fifty fifty or whatever the percentage that I'm See, sorry, now, now, those two people work out. Whatever percentage now they I'm work out. I'm about to take my shit back because now it's like I forgot I got biz in my corner. So they gonna have to, <laughs> they gonna they gonna have to up the ante. You feel me? I, like, I, 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 I'm gonna tell you where y'all fuck it up at, okay? Because you know what? they own you for life, okay? It gives you five hundred million. So that's royalties. Uh, no, no, okay, that's, no, 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 no. It give you five hundred million, nigga. Take uh, this, uh, uh, okay. <laughs> okay, okay. Right, it sounds sound good when you go. I uh, listen. I ain't gotta pay it back. Y'all, that's all publish. This, this how I feel. This how I feel. Come on, bro. I feel like I feel like that's Come one. On, people, this, can I say something, please? I'm sorry. That, that's one minute. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, just getting this money. Okay, we got somebody chance a rapper. Okay, nigga, I'm gonna do all my shit. Right. Because people fuck with me. Right. I'm gonna do my own marketing. Right. And do everything else, and I'm gonna get all this money that I don't have to pay back. Millions of dollars that earn my fucking self, movie, world, sees everything. Okay. That I'm gonna get my fucking self because I bust my ass to make this shit happen. I got you. Fuck that. Okay. I, you want five minutes? No, nigga, I'm gonna get my millions myself, nigga. Right. I'm gonna keep on bouncing out there and making my shit. I'm, I'm, cause it's the work but ethic, this, and then I'm good. But, I'm chilling. I'm chilling. I'm chilling. You gotta step out, use the restroom right quick. Yeah, yeah. I got a TT. You hear what I'm trying to say? Listen, I'm gonna bust my no, ass. I agree look, with you. Look, look, I'm gonna bust okay, my ass. Okay. I you gotta pay that money back, bro. The same dude you, you talking about. Back. The same dude you talking about did a deal with Apple and a record label for two million dollars. The same dude, and that was with. Bro, that was with. Up, no, 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 no. Up. He didn't no. do it. That was with an album. He was a millionaire before he, had, he came. He was a millionaire before he blew up. But he already had a connect inside with Spotify. This is what I'm saying. In order to get that big pub, he was a SoundCloud rapper that got huge, right? You get Absolutely. you pay SoundCloud at least to go pro. You go pro on SoundCloud all year, you're literally published to the whole freaking world. But I, that's I, how your numbers get up. I, I think but, but, but somebody I'll, start I'll, coming I'll in also, and paying you I'll for also, shows. I feel like I'll you're making put, 10 to 15 racks. You could easily put that money back easily, into that. But he right? Think, he think he made touring before that. He before w- it, wasn't no label touring. coming at him at that time. Yeah, but he didn't have to. But then it came up. He made his money touring. But if you have a name for yourself, you believe your art, you don't have to work for a label that's going to pay you all this fucking money that you eventually go have to pay back. Why not have this money you go sit on and be no, cool? I see, no, you're looking. You're He's looking, still doing it like that, bro. Okay, so you're, you're look, still doing it like that. It don't it without a okay, label. Okay, so that's but you have to understand. There's few ways to look at this. The label is just not just signing a label deal. A lot of sometimes artists get publishing deals through labels. Absolutely. Right. And that's free money. That's money off the work that you already put okay. in. Okay. So if the work that you put in is worth $5 million, uh, guess what? Is that part of the 360 deal? 
Orchard? No, it's not. Bro, Orchard as a publishing company works with a lot with Sony and all these big companies. You do a deal with Sony, Orchard is giving you a check off of publishing because they put yeah. it into movies. They put it into all this. Of course, if they paid you $5 million to publish your music out there, they go get their money off of that. Mm -hmm. yeah. That little $5 million? Yo, nigga, that get that streaming? But if you even get that Come type on, of... Come on, man. If you, streaming? If you even getting that type of coin... Yo, they go get their yeah, money, bro. Yeah, yeah, for sure. It's not money that you have to. Okay, I, I see what you're looking I, I, at. I like if you do, if said, you do a label, is, is that a given though? Is that a given with your work ethic and, and your your publicity and who people know who you are? Is that a given that you could get that going if you set a 360 deal instantly? Oh, so that's my that's, thing. That's, that's off that's work. Thing. That's off is your that work ethic. Given? Though? So, so not everybody got that work ethic though. I'm not saying y'all don't, but I'm saying not everybody had that work ethic right. that. It's all gonna be okay. No, they don't. There's you a lot of saying? no. You're right. There's a lot of people out here signing bad deals. Yeah, for but sure. I'm saying if you're gonna look at signing a label deal at a 360, you should look at all the benefits and the cons, the mm -hmm. pros and the cons. Just not. So if you make a deal and you make a decision off of something, yeah. you made that decision off of your own foundation of knowing. Okay, I went into this Man. knowing that this was gonna be this. Mm -hmm. A lot of these cats don't know what's in their label deal. They just happy signing checks. They just happy getting a check. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not talking about the average artist. I'm not the average artist. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? Uh, uh, DJ Mar is not the average artist, of I, course. I but what I'm saying is, we have to look at. Not everything is bad because it had a bad name on it. In the beginning, 360s had a horrible name on it. Yes, because they didn't know what to do. But now they say, well, if we tie up with all the with all the movie stations, I'm sorry, with all the uh, uh, right, movie yeah. studios. Yeah. You know what I mean? The record labels are saying this. We tie up with all the music studios, we um uh, uh movie studios. We tie up with all the PR companies. We tie up with all this. We got but the that's connect. That's why they're gonna be able to put you in position, though. Yeah. Right, can I ask you a question, though? Lizzo, they they did Lizzo okay. at five million, right? Okay. Lizzo, five million. Okay. How much money you think Lizzo gave them back? I have no idea. Forty million dollars they made off of Lizzo, bro. Okay. Can I ask you a question? And more. And that was that wasn't even a whole project. That was that one song. That was that one. Yeah, that one wow. album. That was that one little. Joint. Okay, so let me ask you something. Do every artist? Okay, tell me an artist right now that's mainstream killing the game that got three sixty deal right now. There's a gang of them out there. Tell me something. I'll give it's you mainstream right now. The well, right now, well, well. Tory just got out of his. You know what I mean? Absolutely. He just, which he was so happy about, and yeah. he ended up doing a big old party. He, he, he about, you know what I mean? Yeah, he Tori is about to see a bag, bro. Yeah, absolutely. See what? Yeah. No, no, absolutely. no. But you gotta look at after he made a name, and you already got that plateau. He don't need no machine. But his work no he don't crazy. need no machine no more. He's already like, gave these people his, three, four albums already. His yeah. quarantine radio hit almost right. seven hundred thousand people. Like, so yeah. he's good. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like every time. Yeah. But he that's, needed that's that crazy. label hit. Yeah, yeah. He needed that label hit to push him up there. True. His first show was with Sean Kingston and Justin Bieber, right? Yeah. Not right. saying that he knew anything. It was just that he was cool with one of them, you know what I mean? And that's how he got on the stage, you know? Fact. But, I mean, people, don't look at signing a bad deal is always bad. Please look at the pros and cons. Um, don't act like we didn't see the TLC movie when the new yeah, edition for stay sure. woke. Of course, you that's know what I mean? But they didn't know. They was excited. T TLC, yeah, and they was excited. They was so excited when they signed that deal. But anyway, people, um, <laughs> we go. Thank you guys for uh, uh, tuning in live. <laughs> D Jamal, what's up with the new project before we get out of here? What's up with the new project? Yes, sir. The new man. movie. I mean, I'm sorry, the music video that I just saw today, Beach Chairs. Beach Chair is out now, man, on YouTube. Papa Z Films is in the building. You know what I'm saying? If you need any artwork, video. Did, um, Papa Z directed that and put that together, right? Directed it, filmed it, you know what I'm saying? That's awesome. That's yeah, real awesome. So we getting everything put together, man. Right, right, Shout right. Shout out to the guys. Tribe, you did, Gas Mask Tribe and all that. <laughs> Appreciate it, bro. Keep doing your thing, fam. Yes, sir. Uh, you want to give them some before we go? Comedy? Yeah, yeah. Uh, no. Um, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> follow me on Instagram, The Real Zio Worlds, The Real Zo World. Follow me. I'm, I'm actually going live with some comedy. Oh really? Uh, next week, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, going live. going live on in here. You got got a show. I got a show, but it's gonna be live on. Where you gonna be at? Oh, on, my, on my live. Oh, on your. Why don't you come here? Do the show here too. Okay, I can do that too. I can do that too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>
Why not? <laughs> people, people just come in the studio and diss. So like, I'm going to do it at home on Zoom. Like, I ain't <laughs> I fucking with y'all. <laughs> I, 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 bro, I, I would love to. I would love come to. Come on, man. I'm glad, I, I I'm glad we put this bro, card. This what day are you doing it? I'll do the Thursday. What time? See? No, 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 Come on. Yes, Wednesday. you are doing no, no, it on a Thursday. No, 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 <laughs> <laughs> I know the show Thursday. It's doing a Wednesday. Day before. We're yes. going to talk after the show. All right, let's talk. Let's go. See? Yeah. That's what I'm saying, people. Oh, yeah, man. Make sure y'all Coming follow together. me on Instagram, man. At d.jamal. D.J.A.M.A.A.L. Chia. Six two. It's your boy, boy. It's your boy, boy, man. Follow us, young brother, yo. Long yes. Beach in the building. Long this is the Gas Mash Tribe, everyone. I am Biz, your host, the musician, the entertainer, the all the motherfucking damn. I mean, I'm like a middle fucking renaissance man. You did? <laughs> renaissance man. You know? But the new album coming out pretty soon. Um, well, pretty soon. It's in like three days, three, four days. Yes, uh, sir. Also, go, that. Go, go see Beach Chairs. It's out right now. Directed, produced by Papa Z. Artist. Um, big name artist. He don't know it yet, but big name artist, DJ Jamal. Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Go. go check out the video. Gas Mask Try where we filter out the bull. Boom. Yep, and thank you so much. Cheers. Yeah, see you soon. Share this podcast. Hey, feel single, y'all. Feel Share single, y'all. Feel, feel the single, y'all. The, the, don't the, don't the, tell the them that. <laughs> yes, yes. We need all the cougars come out. <laughs> I, don't got, I don't have no. no money, so if you're looking for it, <laughs> bank account say overdrawn. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't no chicken. Going that quarantine money. money. Ain't coming. <laughs> we out here. This is for the ones who say we will make it. This is for the ones who say we will take it. Never let you down, you the real reason. This a billion dollar smile never came easy. This might be the one couple label deals. This might give me keep from paying a bitch a meal. And yes, I brought a gang, call us dirty up. Billion dollar beers, I'm from California. Oh, that's what you mean, fuck your own opinion. This is what I bleed, I'm the fucking innocent Buy a couple countries for my little junior Yeah, this is not a dream, this is how we're living This is for the team, cause we too legit This is for the ones that would never quit Never let them see you throw it all away Get your money up and flip and let it increase Crazy. How would just to run away? Working on my crap, be famous one day now I got a team running in place. Yeah, it's all cash, ain't no Billy J. This is for the ones who say we will make it. This is for the ones who say we will take it. Never let you down, you the real reason. This is being down now, never came easy. This is for the ones who say we will make it. This is for the ones who say we will take it. Never let you down, you the real reason. This a billion dollar smile, never came easy My eyes sitting low, smoking on some cake She eyes sitting low, loaded up the tank Ain't man any hater, make him all the rich She ain't got no paper, so there is no case Pay, pay back is a real bitch, I'm an outlaw to the president Black skin, that's melanin, yo girl love her dick Ride around in my London house, feel good when them tits out She loves to make love outside, this is the life that I dream about Smoke lungs in my lungs high Gas mask, this west side. Middle finger to the five oh four hundred years of this black life. Don't matter, my four five. Bone thugs in this two pot. Outcast in this Eminem, yeah, that's the code that I live by. How would just to run away? Working on my crap, be famous one day. Now I got a team running in place. Yeah, it's all cash, ain't no Billy J. This is for the ones who say we will make it. This is for the ones who say we will take it. Never let you down, you the real reason. This a billion dollar smile, never came easy. This is for the ones who say we will make it. This is for the ones who say we will take it. Never let you down, you the real reason. This a billion dollar smile, never came easy. I, I, I would